Hello everyone, this is Andrew from Galileo Sky. Today we will create an algorithm to remind the driver about the necessity to fasten his safety belt and turn on the headlights. On the screen you can see conditions of the current task. You can try to make this algorithm yourself. Just pause this video and then check your algorithm with what we eventually made. Let's do it! It is necessary to check belt and lights only when the vehicle is turned on and moving. The driver wouldn't like to listen to the buzzer signals while standing on a parking lot. We use two simple conditions – checking the ignition using input 0 and checking current speed. Speed variable is working with data in kilometers per hour, so we just set limit to be above 5 kilometers per hour. If any of the condition is false, we create a delay and go back to both conditions, thus creating a cycle. Our next step is to check the voltage levels on the belt sensor and the headlight sensor. If both conditions are true, we again go back to the start of the algorithm. However, if any of the inputs does not show required voltage levels, we should send one SMS message as we did in lesson 2.3. Back there we had one and the same condition for both messages, so we used one flag variable. Here the conditions are different, which means we will need two separate flags. And now we use familiar scheme to set message sending. Finally, we set the buzzer work in case of violations. For the belt we simply open the output, while for the lights we create two output openings with 100 milliseconds delay. In both cases, we further go back to checking all the conditions. And in order to repeat these reactions, we direct non-working driver, fasten safety belt and working headlights to the beginning, where we know the flags and close the output. And in order to make the algorithm more easy to understand, we change some numbers by variables.
Great, the algorithm is ready for use. Now both the driver and the dispatcher will receive notifications in case of violation, thus increasing driving safety. You can create other algorithms similar to this one for your projects. If you have any questions left, write them in the comments section. Like and share this video with your clients and colleagues who are studying EasyLogic technology. And subscribe to our channel to get notified about new EasyLogic Creators videos. Good luck in creating your unique solutions!